Maureen Akwe, everybody. Uh, core Craig, Core O, Craig. Uh, core Te uh, Mahi, uh, Boss Te O Core Te Mahi Ne. Today is when we uh, celebrate a very great moment in our wonderful history and talk about a topic that gets a few people pretty heated up. That's right, it's the topic of the Treaty of Waitangi, yeah? Kia ora, Errol. Uh, kia ora, Craig. Maybe you'd like to introduce yourself, Errol. Mm. <clears throat> Hi, everyone. My name's Errol. Right, so can anyone tell me when was the Treaty of Waitangi signed? Errol. 1840. Correct. <laughs> Kapai Errol. Now, can anyone tell me where it was signed, eh? Hey? Or you might know this one, Errol. In Waitangi. Ha, ah, yes, Waitangi. Can anyone tell me who the treaty was signed between? Yeah? Simon, good on you having a go at this one. I believe it was an agreement between the Kiwis and the Maoris. Uh, uh, tie whore there, Carl. Simon, I don't think you're quite right, but you're pretty close. Well, like, you know, like the Kiwis and anyone who's not a Kiwi. Uh, once again, not quite there. I thought Maoris were Kiwis. Um, the agreement was between the Queen of England and the Maori sovereignty. Mm. Mm. Wonderful, 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 wonderful. Try. would you like to add anything to that? Hey? I thought you might want to talk about your treaty, yeah? Uh, I don't think there was any. Hmm, okay, because I thought that um, all uh, countries that came into being uh, the, with the brown people uh, met and signed, you know, the col colonies, there was the colonisers, yeah? And, and that when... Uh... I'm out. There, you see? This is what the treaty is all about, yeah? It's about us understanding and knowing when to give our brothers their space. Great job today, everyone. Wonderful. Well done, Carl. Jerome. All of you guys. Yeah?